So today we, um, the Pesticide Action Network of North America released a new report called Kids on the Front Line um, that is about the impact of pesticides on children's health, um, especially rural children's health. So we, um, in 2012, released another study called Generations in Jeopardy that was about children's health in general, and today is a follow-up because um, what's happened since then is that the science has gotten increasingly clear that there is, um, you know, that pesticides are linked to health harms in, in rural kids. This was a national report that we released, um, but it includes specific information towards Iowa as an agricultural state. And so I think this is really important for us here because, you know, as most Iowans know, there's agriculture all around us. Um, and I think that we really need to um, step up and um, figure out how to, how to transition to different methods while still maintaining, um, you know, vibrant rural communities because that's what we have here in Iowa. I know there are many people who are interested in organic food and also in worrying about pesticides, let's just put it that way. And um, I'm very happy that it's growing at a rate of somewhere. The sales of organic uh, food is growing in the range for the last 15 years, somewhere in the range of 20% a year. I mean, it's a very viable business model, I think. And I, uh, there are many different kinds of farmers of all different varieties that uh, produce organic vegetables and I vegetables and, and meats and I uh, support all of them. I find every, every one of them something of a unique people and very interesting and I, I think we all are trying to live our own lives healthily and, and, uh, and provide for our families as well. Yeah, so we're really hoping um, to get the conversation started. I think that sometimes um, pesticides can seem um, scary and we have a lot of farming in Iowa and so I think that sometimes it's hard to start talking about it and so I think that a scientific report is a great way to be like okay the science is here this is happening what can we do about it so I think our hope is to get the conversation started on a statewide level not just about um, pesticides from a farming perspective but also from a health perspective and then um, we also have been involved with a coalition of farm organizations that have been working on statewide legislation and so there's plenty of ways both both at the local level here, here in Johnson County and communities throughout the state, also on the statewide level through um, legislative work that we hope to continue next year.